Good day, students. In today's lesson, we will be proceeding to another MAPI component, which is music. The second quarter lesson for music will focus on the classical period. So let's start with a little background about the classical times and the kind of music produced during this time. The classical era, also called Age of Reason, is the period from 1750 to 1820. The cultural life was dominated by the aristocracy as patrons of musicians and artists who generally influence the arts. Significant changes in musical forms and styles were made. The term classical denotes conformity with the principles and characteristics of ancient Greece and Roman literature, and art which were formal, elegant, simple, freed, and dignified. Harmony and texture during the classical period is homophonic in general. Now let's proceed to the different vocal and instrumental music that became famous during the classical period. Let's start with the different kinds of instrumental music, meaning music that has no voice and only music. The first one is what we call sonata. This is a multi-movement work for solo instrument. Sonata came from the word sonare, which means to make a sound. This term is applied to a variety of works for a solo instrument, such as keyboard or violin. There are three movements in a sonata. First movement is allegro, which is a fast movement. Second movement has a slow tempo, like andante, largo, etc. This is mostly lyrical and emotional. And the third movement is called minuet. It is in 3-4 time and in a moderate or fast tempo. Next one is what we call sonata allegro form. This is the most important form that was developed during the classical era and it consists of three distinct sections. The first section is called exposition. This is the first part of a composition in sonata form that introduces the theme. Second is development. This is the middle part of the sonata allegro form wherein themes are being developed. And last section is called recapitulation. This repeats the theme as they first emerge in the opening exposition. Next one is called concerto. Concerto is a multi-movement work designed for an instrumental soloist and orchestra. A concerto has three movements. The first movement is fast, which is the sonata allegro form with expositions of the orchestra and then by the soloist. The second movement is slow. It has more ornamentation than the first movement. And the third movement is fast, which is the finale, and it is usually in a form of rondo, resembling the last movement of the symphony, and usually a short cadenza is used. Next is what we call symphony. This is a multi-movement work for orchestra. The symphony is derived from the word sinfonia, which literally means a harmonious sounding together. It is a classical music for the whole orchestra. It generally has four movements. First movement is fast, sonata allegro form. Second movement is slow, gentle, lyrical, and typical ABA form or theme and variation. Third movement is medium or fast, which uses a dance form which is minuet or scherzo. Fourth movement is fast, typically rondo or sonata form. After the instrumental music, there is one particular vocal music that became popular during the classical time, and it was the classical opera. Opera is a drama set to music where singers and musicians perform in a theatrical setting. It has two distinct styles. First one is called opera seria, 
which means serious opera. Usually implies heroic or tragic drama that employs mythological characters which was inherited from the Baroque period. Second style is opera buffa, which means comic opera. This is from Italy, which made use of everyday characters and situations and typically employed spoken dialogues, lengthy arias, and was spiced with sight gags, naughty humor, and social satire. Here are some other important terms to remember in this lesson. The first one is singspiel. This is an opera based on a serious plot that usually revolves around mythological beings such as gods and goddesses. Aria, a separate song, usually for one voice. Recitative, it's the style of delivery in which a singer can adopt the rhythms and delivery of the ordinary speech. Bel canto is an Italian phrase which means beautiful singing. Grand opera means a spectacular opera. Music drama is a style of opera that is created by a single artist who writes both the text and the music to advance the drama. Alberti bass, which is a special type of broken chord accompaniment where the chord is played in this order. Lowest note, to highest note, to middle note, to highest note, then repeats the pattern. Now I will introduce you to the famous classical music composers and their musical pieces. First we have Franz Josef Haydn. He is one of the most prominent composers of the classical period. His life is described as rags to riches. He came from a poor family and his music led to his rise in social status. He was named the father of the symphony. Most of his symphonies have nicknames such as the Surprise Symphony, the Clock, and the Military. Next is Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart. Mozart is a child prodigy and the most amazing genius in musical history. He experimented in all kinds of music and composed over 700 works. Unfortunately, due to mismanaged finances, he lived his life in poverty. He composed wonderful concertos, symphonies, and opera such as The Marriage of Figaro, Don Giovanni, and The Magic Flute which became popular. Other known works are I Incline Not Music, Symphony No. 40 in G Major, and Sonata No. 11 in A Major, K311. Another is Ludwig van Beethoven. He was the composer who bridged the late classical era and the early romantic era. He was a talented pianist and composer. He began to go deaf in 1796, but this did not become a hindrance. He continued composing through the help of an assistant and hearing gadget. Some of his famous compositions were made when he was deaf. His works include famous symphonies like Symphony No. 3, like Eroica, No. 5, No. 6, which is Pastoral, and No. 9, which is Choral. Other famous works are Piano Sonata No. 14 in C-sharp minor, which is the Moonlight Sonata, Piano Concerto No. 5 entitled Emperor in E-flat major, Symphony No. 5, C minor, and the most famous one, which is for Elise. Did you know that works of Haydn, Mozart, and Beethoven are still popular today? Their compositions are now commonly used as music to animated series of popular cartoon companies such as Looney Tunes, Warner Brothers, 20th Century Fox, Pixar, etc. Here are some examples. Watch and listen to these videos.
To generalize all the lesson, just remember that music of the classical era is usually associated with the nobility or the rich people. During that time, most of the members of the nobility would financially support the musicians. Music was played in the courts which makes the music of the classical era more familiar to the nobility than the lower classes. This association of the rich and classical music is still being experienced in some parts of the world. However, with the dawn of radio and TV, classical music may now be experienced by the masses. And that is all for our lesson today. I hope you learned many things about the music of the classical period. This time, here are the activities you need to do in your music modules this second quarter. If you have noticed, after Module 1 is already Module 3. That's because there is no Module 2 in music. The next one is already entitled Module 3. So even if it is Module 3, it is just the second module. And that would be the end of our discussion today. Thank you for listening and see you in our next lesson.